Welcome back. Alan Bristow joins us now for a look at evening sports. Tomorrow night will be a very exciting night in the city as the curtain will go up on the first CIS home games for the UMBC basketball teams tomorrow evening. Now these banners remain from their days in the Pac West League, but the Canadian College banner will go down and the CIS banner will go up tomorrow. Trinity Western will be the first visitor to the Northern Sports Centre. The team was hoping for a good crowd that could help them lead them past the Spartans who are team for the taking. I would love to see more than 1,500 people out here. I mean, I'd love to see it packed. Uh, we've, uh, I've got a picture in my office of when the women hosted in 2008 uh, the provincial championships and the gym is it's standing room only. If we can have that, that would be wonderful. And that's really what we want to see the community do is come out and support. It's, it's great family entertainment and you're going to see two very hardworking teams this weekend. And they're a strong team. They've got some really good athletes um, coming in. They're, you know, I would say they'll be somewhere in the, the middle of Canada West, middle to top end. I mean, they're, they're the type of team that, you know, for us to, you know, look at a playoff spot and those sort of things, that, that they're the type of level of team that we're going to have to beat this year. So um, it's a really good challenge for us, and it should be really good basketball for the first weekend. And besides raising the banner tomorrow night in between the two games, that'll be around 7.40. A few players will also be recognized for their All-Canadian Awards from last year. Women, do tip off tomorrow night 6, the men at 8. The Lady Timberwolves will look for their first win after opening 0-2 at Thompson Rivers. The men, by the way, 1-1 to start the season after splitting last weekend at TRU.